Hey everybody, um, this video is going to show you how to import your recorded audio into your project. Okay, um, so I have my project open um, and I have my music set up here. You can do this before your music is set up or after. Remember, I, I, um, I have my music in three sections. So the top was my intro, this section is my music break, and then I already moved something over. All right. Um, it may be a good idea to do your automations after you have already imported your auto audio. Okay, um, so this is how this is gonna work. All right, I'm gonna add a new track. Okay, I'm gonna. It doesn't matter which one you pick. Okay, then you click on this uh, the the track options wheel. Okay, and then you click import. Okay, now I have already recorded my audio um, I used uh, a f my phone um, I did a voice recording and then I um, sent it to my Google Drive using the Google Drive app on my phone and I will explain how to do this um, you can also record directly into Soundtrap and I'll show you how to do that as well all right um, but I saved it in my music technology folder and then my final podcast project so then I had my my intro here okay um, so you just navigate to wherever it is uh, on your Chromebook okay so I click open and then it imports it right in now if I click the solo button you can hear the audio welcome to mrs. Peters perfectly positive podcast okay so that's my wife she recorded the audio okay so um, I'm going to label this introduction okay and then I'm gonna move this up because it's gonna make more sense for it to be right after my intro music um, as far so I just clicked and dragged and brought it up and you can see the little um, the dots show you gotta grab it like up here and then the dots show where it's gonna go okay so I have all my music here. I'm going to turn off the solo button. So I have all of my music here. I need to move this down so that it starts after my intro music happens. So let me zoom out a little bit, okay? And it'll be easier to move it. So I want it to start right as my music is fading out, okay? Now if I play it like this, There's a lot of dead space, right? So I'm going to move it over a little bit, okay? Um, and let's see how this sounds. Welcome to Mrs. Peter's Perfectly Pop. Okay, so that was a little bit too early. So let me zoom in a little, and it'll let me move it over a little bit more. I think we're going to start it. You notice this audio starts where this little sound wave is this blurb. So I'm going to start it as the music's fading out. So let's see what that sounds like. Welcome to... Yeah, I can even go a little bit earlier. Do it here. Welcome to Mrs. Peter's Perfectly Positive Podcast, where together we will... Okay, so the intro... Okay, I'm going to zoom out again. So you can see the intro is this long. Now, I already set up my music, right? So I have this whole big group of music here that's going to happen, it needs to happen after I've imported my audio, okay? So what I need to do is move this over, all right? The best way to do this is I start over in this corner, I click and hold down my click, and I'm dragging to make a box. Notice how it's selecting everything, okay? So I select all this and I let go. Now everything is selected. Anywhere I grab in here, if I grab it and click and hold, it moves it all as a chunk, okay? And now I can slide it all over so that it's where I need it to be, okay? So this all moves as a group. All right, so I'm going to move it over because I do need to still put in my, um, I need to put in my, I'm going to put in my, um, interview the first half of the interview questions I'm going to show you how to do that in a different video okay 
So what you need to worry about right now is having your intro music, your 32 bars. I'll zoom in again so you can see. Okay, 32 bars of your intro music, and then it should fade out into the introduction that you recorded. Okay, so it will have um, the the introduction all the way at the end, and then we'll just make sure it be an that integral part of the Highland School and Midland Park communities and someone who has positively impacted others. Okay, so it ends right there. All right, so then the next video will show you how to um, import and split up your interview questions. Don't forget to save.